Hey guys, it's Ken from KBD Productions TV. Welcome back to another Kendomic food adventure just for you. I flew all the way from Toronto to Vancouver and before I came here, I asked on my social media, where should I go and where should I eat? And a gentleman by the name of Edgar said, Ken, if you're going to Vancouver, you gotta go to Japa Dog and then go to White Spot or another place and order the double bacon or something. But I found a Japa Dog. Let's go check this out. So they got a lot of things on the menu, but I was told this is like the number one thing people order. It's got a Kurobuta pork teriyaki sauce, Japanese mayo, fried onions, and seaweed. It is $8.29. Let's buy that, check it out, see if it's any good. Hello. Uh, I'd like to try your number one. I guess I'll do the, the special combo. So the number one, uh, obviously a drink and the shake fry. Yeah, three spray butter dry. What's uh, your most popular? Butter and shoy. Okay, let's do it. Thank you. food, got a drink, I went with uh, iced tea. No lid, no straw, don't need it. And there's gonna be a close up. I was just gonna order the dog and then they had that special. And I don't remember how much it came out to. It's like... Mine was 8.25. 8.25? I don't know what it came out to, sorry guys. So there is my dog. And I went with it because it was their number one thing on the menu. And then he said their most popular fries are the um, the butter soy. And there you are, extreme close up. They smell good. Oh wow, really salty. And they taste like soy. Oh. Mm. I don't think I've ever had that before. I think one of the shake a shake of fries things that I had from Japan kind of kind of similar. But they are doused. Wow. Tastes like um, seasoned salt with a side order of soy sauce on it. Oh, good. It's getting this dog. Cheers. So, as you can see from behind me, lots of people non stop coming in here ordering food people in there don't have any chance of a break. Whoa, the dog is falling out the backside. I thought there was gonna be a little bit of a seal, but no, no seal on this sucker. Wow. All right guys, check that out. Scratch it, sniff it. The rest is mine. My seaweed's falling out everywhere. Let's take a bite. Mmm. Tastes more like a sausage than a hot dog. Sausage on a bun. The mayo's adding a nice flavor to it. The seaweed, I can't really taste the seaweed. Mm. That one, I taste the seaweed and that Japanese mayo. I like that. I did talk to a couple locals and when we told them where we were going, we we're like, what's your favorite dog? I'm like, eh, they're just hot dogs. I don't get it. And those are the locals. This place is packed, so they keep coming back. Mm. I'm really enjoying the seaweed on this. It's really uh, kind of bringing it all together. <laughs> it's like I'm eating sushi because of the seaweed. This whole thing is pretty filling. Whoa! 
It's windy. Beautiful day here in Vancouver. I think we got two days. It's Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Good days. Saturday, 70% chance rain, which is the day we're going on our cruise. So we're going to enjoy all these moments as best we can. My wife had the avocado one. What do you think? It's good. Yeah? Would you order that again? Yeah. That's, what's, that's the best rating right there. Would you come back here and order that same thing again? And the answer is yes for the avocado. Uh, I would definitely order this again for sure. It is yummy. Perfectly cooked. Yeah. Nice bun. Nothing special about the bun. Just put the combination of the Japanese stuff on this basically sausage. Totally changes it up. Totally changes it up a bit. And it tastes like I'm eating sushi. Not the raw fish sushi, but it just has that sushi flair to it. That's what I'm trying to get at. So just the dog is $8.29 plus taxes. Uh, and then you get that $5 upgrade to get a, a big drink and a huge bag of fries. Uh, I suggest you get the upgrade, but I'm just not sure if this is worth $8.29. I'm thinking like a, a sausage downtown Toronto is like, like that and a drink, uh, like a can of pop. I think, uh, nice Ferrari just went by. I think it's usually around four or five dollars. So the fact that just this by itself is eight dollars, it is good, but I'm not sure if I want to spend eight dollars uh, on a hot dog or a sausage. All right guys, last bite. <laughs> All right guys, I am all done. On my rating scale, I'm gonna give Jappa Dog the number one on the menu. Uh, I'm gonna give it a total recommend. If you're in Vancouver and you want something very unique and different, uh, get the Jappa, or come to Jappa Dogs. Grab that number one. Uh, again, the price is a bit high, but I'm gonna say this time it is worth it. Uh, if you have two people, just get one bag of fries because there's a lot of fries. I'd like to thank Edgar for recommending this place. Thank you very much, buddy. If you guys love these videos of me going to different cities and trying cool foods and you don't want to miss the next one, please hit that subscribe button. It sits right around here. Click the notification bell. And if you want to show your support for me doing these videos just for you, hit it with a thumbs up. Ding, 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 ding. And we'll see you next time on another Kendamic food adventure. Kendamic out. Cheers.